Hey, it was Adam Fotex, but now one here, and as you guys can see, 12,000 points. 10,000 points for the Game Changer back bundle. Yeah, we're doing this again. Um, I, I know, I know, I know, I know. I'm dumb. I'm the dumbest guy on YouTube because I keep opening packs, and I don't get anything out of these packs whatsoever. But I'm like, yo, if I can just make 500k back out of these packs, I'm cool. 500k is, is reasonable, right? The topper gives you 70,000 coins for the Elite Badge, plus the Elite Player can give you 30,000 coins and upwards to 400,000 coins, which would be amazing. If I could pull Brandon Marshall, uh, Antonio Brown, one of those amazing cards goes for a nice chunk of change. And if I can just pull some Road to the Playoff Elites that go on these sets and some valuable gold cards and the gold badge itself, like I pretty much should be fine with these packs, but I am not open to these bad boys right now. I'm going to go ahead and wait just because... The Thanksgiving promo is rolling up, and unlike everybody else, I don't really think that is going to be too different from last year. Last year, Thanksgiving promo was they gave us collectibles, food collectibles. You had to go ahead and put those in sets for a cornucopia pack to pull an elite uh, Emmett Smith, RG3, Darrell Revis, or Randy Moss. And there was a super, super, like, 0 0.000000000001 divide that by two chance of pulling and one of those elite players out of a regular pro pack. And I don't think that like it's just going to be really, really tough for those cards to pull out of these packs. I would assume if they copied last year's promo. So I'm going to save these packs maybe until happy hour, maybe until the ghost promo. So I'm going to keep sitting on these bad boys. I even may open these packs when I hit 25,000. Like I, 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 <laughs> There's a lot of options, a lot of, a lot of variety that I might have with these packs. So let's go ahead and get this bad boy bought. And I'm also going to hold on to the elite badge and elite road to the playoff topper just because. I want to go ahead and wait. Right now, everything is cheap, yo, and I would be so tempted to sell that car right now. Everything on the auction block is super cheap. So if you guys do uh, not have a great team, I highly recommend you go to the auction block. And also stay tuned. There will be a series on this channel upcoming for some amazing golden road to the playoff gym. So anyway, enough filibustering. Let's go ahead and buy this bundle. Oh, it's just so expensive. But these packs have been good to me in the past. As you guys saw, my 20k package of Ganza, 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 Ganza. I ended up pulling some pretty good elites, most elites. Like, pro packs have been awful to me this year. Like, I opened up like 480 plus pro packs, maybe more than, maybe 500. <laughs> I opened a lot. And two elites out of, oh, three actually, three elites out of the pro packs. Whereas this, like, I'm trying to think how would they equal, like, make sense in math wise. So 500 pro packs at, let's do the math, right? Let's do the math. Let's do the math on my phone real quick. So I'm going to go ahead and come back real quick after I do all the calculations. All right, so I just did the calculation. So let's just say I opened up 300. <laughs> All right, so I did a calculation. Let's just go ahead and round up the pro pack number to 500. I opened up 500 pro packs, pulled three elite cards, and if you do the math for how much that equals up to, that is 3,750,000 coins I put into pro packs for nothing. Three elites. And wait, they weren't great elites. It was like 86 John Kuhn, 86 Mario Williams, 86 Derek, Tom like Derek, Derek Thomas, Derek Johnson. So those are the cards I pull out of those packs. But the Game Changer pack, I opened up, I opened up 18 in that video. I opened up two yesterday, and I'm going to do 10 sometime soon. So that's 30. 30 Game Changer packs is going to cost me 2 point. 1 million now you can go to factor in the silver cards being rare plus the gold cards going in sets i'm not counting that right now i'm just counting in i got a better buy out of the game changer pack bundle last time so we'll try luck again and these packs sat for a while like they're so tempting to open but yeah let's go to get right into it go ahead and buy this bad boy 10,000 points and i still got 2,000 points left over for a pro pack well we're gonna, pro packs are good I'm, I'm done opening those i'm done unless happy hour comes around so Let's just go ahead and sit on that. I know you guys want to see the Elite Top. I just want to give you guys the update. I'm opening these packs, and I got to get my reserve limit down. I got to go ahead and wait for something good to come out. But these bad boys will be open sometime soon. I'm just not sure when. If the Thanksgiving promo is excellent, then it'll be around then. If not, maybe Christmas, maybe when the Envy... <laughs> maybe when the Super Bowl. <laughs> maybe sometime in January. We'll figure it out, but... That is going to wrap up the video. Hope you guys enjoyed my ranting and rambling. Some of you guys do. Some of you guys get mad at me and say, hey, Texas, just open up the damn packs. Hey, my money, my channel, I do what the hell I want to do. Pretty simple. Peace.